To a younger fan, he's just the pitching coach for the New Hampshire Fisher Cats of the Eastern League, throwing a little BP. But you and I might remember Dave LaRoche as a 14-year Major League veteran who spent some memorable seasons with the New York Yankees. I can still remember when I was playing and uh, probably giving my coaches a hard time. I said, no way I'll ever do that. And I started coaching, found out I really liked it and enjoyed working with the young players and seeing them get better. And uh, I did go around after a couple years of coaching, and every coach I could find that I ever played for, I went and apologized for everything I did. LaRoche was a reliever on the Yankees' 1981 World Series team, but it was 1982 when he unveiled his blooper pitch, nicknamed La Lob. Big leaguers were baffled by it, and no one more so than Milwaukee Brewers slugger Gorman Thomas. LaRoche one and two. Going to throw it again. Here it is. Swings and pops it. This will be fouled again. <laughs> the guys were falling off the bench laughing. He thought the ball slipped out of my hand or something. And I ended up uh, throwing Gorman, I think, like 12 out of 13 or something. And he kept fouling them off and, and fouling them off and getting madder and madder. But not as mad as he was about to get. I tried not to smile or do anything, and not not that I was, all I wanted to do was get him out. That was my goal, and, it, and the pitch worked, so that's why I kept throwing it, but. Uh, he was know. mad. What was he saying to you during that at bat? I'm sure there were some words exchanged. Yeah, you know, I was so locked in, I didn't hear him say anything. You're making that up. You heard every word he said, didn't you? But <laughs> I was told afterwards that he took his helmet up threw it up in the air and hit it and exploded like a watermelon and as I was walking off the field but I did not see that happen. After the game he sent over the ear flap so which was the biggest piece left and uh, signed it gave it to me. Still have it? Uh, somewhere in one of my baseball bags yes. In the interest of fairness Gorman Thomas did manage a single in a rematch one year later. But raspberries aside, it's LaRoche and his LaLob that conquered Storm and Gorman for all time. Well, I'm probably remembered for that more than you know all of my time in the big leagues uh, because it happened in New York. You know, as everybody knows, things that go on in New York definitely get headlines, and I do think more people remember that pitch and the times I threw it than anything else I did.